What's going on dividend chasers? It's the Dividend Bloodhound here, back with another investing episode. Today's super exciting episode, I'm revealing just how much passive income I've made over the last month. This month has been absolutely incredible for my passive income. I have amassed £2,232.13 in passive income on top of my active job, which is absolutely incredible when you think about it. If you want to know just how I make this passive income, do please smash that like button, consider subscribing to the channel and join me after the intro where I will reveal all. Catch you there. Hey again guys, welcome back into my passive income revealed. Absolutely insane figure and I'm going to give you the five ways in which I've made that over the last month. Now, without further ado, I don't want to keep you waiting. I'm going to get involved with the first way in which I make that passive income. The first one is a massive £1,300 a month from my two buy-to-let properties. That's a one-bedroom flat and a two-bedroom apartment, all in the Birmingham area and located near a future HS2 station. Now I get £550 per calendar month from one flat and then £750 from my two bedroom apartment. Hopefully being located near a future HS2 station will hopefully bring me not only the rent and rental increases over the next five or 10 years, but also price appreciation in the purchase price of the properties as well allowing me to potentially remortgage and unlock further capital further down the line. But that is the major way in which I make my passive income at the moment. However, we'll now move on to my passive income number two. And that is right here. It is you awesome lot of people that follow me on my investing journey. Yes, I made £404.95 pence from this channel last month and that figure has been growing every month since I got monetized in June. It's absolutely incredible. My mind is blown by the support that I've been getting from all of you guys and the growth that this channel has experienced over the last 18 months or so since I started. In fact, I don't think it's quite 18 months ago, it's about 14 months. It's grown incredibly well. I feel very, very humbled to be in the position that I am and I hope that I can continue to bring you some good quality, high value content. Hopefully I can continue building on this and in, in future passive income updates, I'll be able to bring you higher figures. I will keep you updated with my rent and I'll keep you updated of my other passive income streams. But this one is the one that will probably change most frequently, both up and sadly if that happens down. Moving on to my third source of passive income, that is my dividend portfolio. So last month I earned £14.28 in passive income from that, and that is all from my dividends, which were of course promptly reinvested. Now that's a little bit of a slow month for me, just based on how and when dividend pay dates are. However, my biggest income for that month was from AT&T, which was a whopping £7.50 just from one share, and I had to do absolutely nothing to gain that and that is the beauty of dividend investing. It is a slow process to build the momentum. My portfolio is only at £6,400 in value at the moment, all geared towards dividend stocks, but hopefully over the coming years and decades that portfolio is going to grow both in terms of dividends reinvested and of course I'm going to keep investing capital as well. Next up is my fourth passive income stream, and this is only a little tiny baby one to be fair. This is my Amazon affiliate program. So as you can see in this video, just below you there, there are books that I find inspiring for my investing, all linked to Amazon. And then there's also the equipment that I use to bring you my YouTube videos. Now, if you click those links and ultimately you go on to buy a product, I earn a tiny bit of commission from that. And over the last month, somebody out there has obviously completed that purchase and I've made £6.65p in commission from that one, all from just having links in my video. So if that was you, a great big massive thank you for that. I appreciate all income, large or small. Moving on to the fifth and final income source for me, that is trading 212 
free shares. Unbelievably, I have made £506.25 in free share income added to my portfolio over the last month. That is absolutely incredible when I think about it. That has actually beaten all my other income sources, even YouTube, in the terms that it has given me. Albeit I can't touch the money for 30 days or more because that's what happens when you get a free share. But I am free to sell the share and move the money elsewhere, which is what I've done. And I've invested that in high growth companies, which will hopefully bring me even more growth over the longer term. The only thing that this doesn't beat is my buy to let rental income but it does come very close to beating one of my apartments which is absolutely insane and that has given me a target to go on and beat over the coming months i have been extremely fortunate this month in terms of the actual free shares that i received i've got three shares in astrazeneca two shares in uber two shares in snapchat and two shares in uber if i didn't already say that or, or unilever sorry um all the rest was made up from the likes of General Electric, EasyJet, all of these little companies that, okay, they're only worth £10 a time, but that's £10 that I literally had to do nothing for other than share my link with you wonderful people. And if you are considering signing up with Trading212, yes, you're absolutely right. I'm going to plug the free shares here. The link to do so is in the description below. There's also a link to free trade as well and stake all of which yourself and myself will get a free share in a company just if you sign up and, inv and invest £50, deposit £50 with stake, deposit £1 with free trade and deposit £1 with trading 212. It's awesome, it's free money, you win and I win, it's brilliant. How can anybody have any issues with that? Leading on from there, I just want to say a massive heartfelt thank you to you all because it mainly comes from you guys supporting this channel, not just in watching my videos, but using the free share links as well, that is rewarding me for helping give you the best content that I can. And that just spurs me on even more. And it's something that I really enjoy doing and answering your questions and getting rewarded for doing so. It's just like an absolute cycle that goes round and round. I help you out, you help me out, and it just gets bigger and better. And that's exactly what I'm hoping to do with this channel. So there you have it friends, my five sources of passive income all analysed for you this month, a whopping total of over £2,000, incredible, of course impossible for the most part without you guys, the buy to let side of things is all me, but everything else from, that, from then onwards is all you guys supporting this channel and I really really just want to say thank you for that. I look forward to essentially reporting on my passive income each month or so. It might not happen every month. It really will depend on my YouTube scheduling, but I will try and get in as best I can. So I hope that you can follow my progress, continue to support each other. You support me, I'll support you with even more content. And then long term, hopefully this channel will continue to grow and I might even get to add with some serious saving, I might even get to add that elusive third buy to let property over the much longer term. But I can continue to update you as and when, and hopefully if you give that like button a smash, this video will get out to even more people and we can all support each other. Thank you very much for watching today, guys. It's been an absolute pleasure as always, and hopefully I will see you in the next investing episode. Catch you there.